Welcome back to Spooky Time with Eddie. Today we're looking at another five nasty ass fools video, specifically from Baddington. Now the last time we looked at some FNAF VHS tapes, but today we're gonna check out the newest video called Non-Existent Video. Now I'm not sure what to expect, but I'm really excited to see this after the last one. So please leave a like. If you're new here, subscribe. But okay, that's enough. Let's get started. Oh, that? That's just Mexican Donkey Kong barrel. It's how Donkey Kong got smuggled across the border. <laughs> Shh. Okay. Hello, new Fredbear employee, and welcome to the mascot costume assembly training tape. The what? There are two types of suits, Fredbear and Bonnie Bon. Oh, it's These how they assemble the suits. Both animatronic suits and wearable costumes for performers. Efficient and eliminates any differences in appearance as to not break the immersion. Wait a minute. So they can both they can go both ways. Now we all know what happens when you get trapped inside the suit, especially if you're trying to perform. Basically, we get to see your bloody gummy worms. <laughs> I never want to say that ever again. <laughs> The wearable costumes will only be used when an animatronic is in repair. Oi! Perate, way! Oh, he said, so this is what it's like to be on stage with. Oh my shit! Wait, look at Freddy! Cabron is meeting. That fool looks so creepy. Like, imagine you being on stage and you look over and you see that. That's f***ed up. Okay, let's get seeing it. Excuse me, who is that? Wait a minute, hold on, pause, who is that? Can't even see, why, why do I pause as if I'm gonna recognize who that is? That's just the person standing there. Unless. It's Michael Afton, Skinwalker, Doppelganger. Twice removed. Did you ever think about that? All right, when do we get to see Kentucky? Cabrón, oh, what? Why is he crawling? That's creepy as shit, yo. I can't understand what he's saying. Oh, God! His face just opened up. He tried to eat. He's hungry. The first layer is a fabric costume that we normally see. The second layer is a fiberglass shell that forms the screen. Hold on, man. You can't just make my man Freddy strip down like that and then not, you know, not, not give, put a dollar on, on, on his undies or some shit. Like, but <laughs> there's a whole job for that. And you just made him do it for free. FNAF OnlyFans page be like. <laughs> the structure of the character. The third layer is. Okay, now you're going all the way. This layer is the closest to your body when being worn. <laughs> It will help support all the weight of the heavy components. Got some and is thick legs though. For holding all the spring locks. Oh. Spring locks are the locks that hold all the springs used to attach to the animatronic. They're actually showing it all. However, these springs can be very dangerous if the suit is not prepped carefully. Now, let's begin the training. So is that what happens when you get to trapped? The costume into suit mode, spring you trap. Shall start by winding up all the spring locks with a hand crank. Insert the hand crank into the lock sockets located behind the animatronic. There are ten lock sockets in total. Uh -huh. Two on each limb, one on the back of the body, and one behind the head. Okay, I never quite really understood what it meant when somebody would get trapped inside of the suit. But now that they actually painted a picture, especially that right there, like if you have your arm through that or your legs and those springs fail and they all penetrate. 
I just got chicken skin. Can't complain though, if you're inside one of those suits. <laughs> what are you gonna say then? I got Swiss cheese skin and full of holes or some shit. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> but okay, keep going. Next, remove the gloves and feet. Uh-huh. Okay. You'll need to Make sure you take off your shoes. Taking off the costume. Simply remove they the look head so as well creepy, as the fiberglass man. structure underneath. That's not creepy at all. But th yeah, that's not creepy then, either. The actual face the is creepy as shit. Once removed, you'll need to detach the fiberglass shell from the exoskeleton. Lastly, remove the exoskeleton from the animatronic. I just noticed that was Theo Fluffy. No wonder he's trying to get naked, man. <laughs> that fool's perverted. To put on the Too much. Next, you'll need to reattach the fiberglass shell back on. Then, put on the fabric layer. Once applied properly, put on the gloves and feet. Lastly, you'll need to put on the head. But before you do, you'll need to put the head into performer mode by winding up a small socket on the inside of the head to reveal the fake eyes. Perfect for to see. Remember when we played uh uh Five Nasty Ass Fools? Where is your sister's location? That one, that one, the sister location one. Hey, remember, remember th that one part where you had to fend off all the little macarenas that were on, they were coming in when you're behind the eye sockets and you're winding all the screws and shit. Is that what they're referring to right here? Because even the faces have spring locks. I just didn't know how it all worked, but it's so, like, this is so new to me. I always heard about, like, people getting messed up inside of the suits, but not like that. It's like you're getting impaled from every part of your body. Don't tell me they have a spring lock on the booty. Oh. <laughs> or on the front. Oh, shit. Kentucky probably enjoys those spring locks. <laughs> In the event of a I need to stop. failure, do not panic. Keep as still as possible and call for help. Calm your breathing. How do you call for help? Wound up the hand crank to lock the spring locks once more. Then safely and gently remove the suit. Orale, way. I'm not reading that. Oh! So, uh, is there someone inside of him right- No! That's scary, dude. Oh god, stop staring at me like that. No me mires así, güey. Stop it. You're making me shy. You're making me blush. I'm just kidding. You're creeping me the fuck out right now. Stop. Stop it. Oh, I bit someone. 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 <laughs> hey, give me a favor. Maybe somehow you can check inside those suits. A bite of 87. Four tapes hit inside their heads. Freddy ripped apart. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Are they all just running through the games now? Hold up. Four tapes hit inside their empty heads. Freddy ripped apart with a smile. Bonnie dancing in the dark. And Toki in her wonderful song. Crackhead-ass Foxy meets the happy man. You are gifted. You found the fifth. Who it is? Michael. There's something I want you to know. Miguel, por favor, cabrón. Before your brother died, something else happened. I cheated on you with your sister. Something was wrong with the suits. And your sister. Watch.
let me tell you a secret. The same thing happened to your father. It killed him. But only for a while. How? How that happens? He's still out there. You want to find him? I'll show you. It's that happy ass fool fucking Fast Bear's Frights. What's that? Don't worry about times, dates, or location. You'll know when it happens. There will be a gasoline canister in the back next to the second exit. And that's how he became tortillas. Your father will be there in the building with you. Burnt tortillas. He will look different, but you will know it's him. Then we can end this. For good. Yo. I know how you feel. Miguel. It's a lot of responsibility. Who's that? But when this is done, we'll be free. You'll be free too. We gotta smuggle you across the board. It may not seem like it, but I believe your brother will forgive you. I've forgiven you too. You are good, Miguel. Despite what you might think, you do deserve this happy ending. Man, f that fool. I've been working all this time to give you that opportunity. No redeem, no redemption. I love you, Miguel. Who is that? I want to know who that is. Let me know down in the comments if you figured it out. Well, folks, it's Clearly, I'm too dumb. Who's that? Just remember that a friend is the best thing you could ever have. When life gets you down, a friend will be there to help. <laughs> yeah. oh, Kind of creepy. That was a fun I got That's... stuck in a water machine. A friend of mine had a cut of hell in it just to get me out. <laughs> That's very creepy that they're like talking like that and there's no one watching them. A little sad. A little sad. That's it! That's it! Man, what happened to the jump scare? I was looking for a jump scare. I was... Well, I did get jump scared once. Anyway, okay, look. I just had to check this out. Initial impression, it's a good f***ing video, as expected. I know these are fan-made, but they're extremely well done. And that part, this shit right here, this was the scariest part of the whole thing. That. That's the creepiest thing I've ever seen. Imagine you walking out of a bathroom and you see this naked ass fool crawling towards you like that. Calling for help with his dumb ass auto-tune voice like <laughs> Hippo looking naked ass plain uncooked tortilla looking ass solid looking like you got some talcum powder on you mother looking like you want to get spanked or some shit. Wait, <laughs> Anyway, that's the stuff for nightmares. Let me know what you thought of uh, the non-existent video of FNAF. I feel like I learned a lot because I didn't know exactly how the spring locks worked in the suits. And after seeing an actual 3D render and how the hands fit through and how you're supposed to put on the suit and how it f***s you up and turns you into bloody spaghetti noodle gummy worms. It just makes the entire FNAF series that much darker, knowing that that happens to you in the suit. Anyway, the more I know, I guess. <laughs> All right, that's it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching Five Nasty Ass Fools. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. Let me know down in the comments what you thought. But that's it for me. I love you guys. And I'm going to see you next time. Bye. Cabrones, ayúdenme, por favor, me estoy muriendo. Ali, you better not make this shit raw. You better actually put the effect I asked you for, motherfucker. <laughs>